Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been a while. So today we're doing makeup, an eyeshadow look. Like, a, I don't know what. It's not gonna be crazy. It's not gonna be like, I think the last time I did like an eyeshadow look was in Christmas. Maybe not even Christmas. Honestly, I can't even remember the last time I did it. That's how long it's been. And I miss it so much, but I just haven't had time at all to do it. So that's what we're doing today. Um, and it should be fun. So let's do this thing. Okay, let's go. I need to prime my face. Um, honestly, I don't know which. Let me call my sister and see. Because Shayla knows everything there is to know about skincare. So let's see what she has to say about it. Hey. It didn't even ring. I was texting and it answered right away. <laughs> Right. Just went oh, okay. I have a question because I'm filming a YouTube video. You're what? you're right here. Ew. <laughs> well, I'm not showing you, so it's okay. Oh. I want to put on this like serum thing, but which one goes first, serum and then moisturizer, or? Serum always goes first because it penetrates your skin deeper and it helps everything go deeper in afterwards. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay.
setting powder. I'm going to go in with this Fit Me loose finishing powder and then put this under my eyes for fallout to sweep it away. I don't know if anyone else can relate to this, but I cannot like do my makeup with makeup on my hands. Like I have to constantly like be like washing them because it, it irritates the shit out of me feeling like that that shit on my fingers and like hands. I think the first thing that I'm gonna go in with is the shade Punch Me and it's this one. Sweep back and forth and build that up into my crease. And these shades go a long way, surprisingly. Like, this is such a good palette for that. I think I'm gonna make this a, a natural look. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with the Soft Glam palette. This is my baby. This is literally my absolute holy grail. I use this every single time I wanna do like a natural type of eyeshadow look. Not natural, but like literally like a soft glam. I'm going to use this tapered brush. It looks like this. I don't know if you can see that. And it's like, it's a little bit tapered on the sides. So like this side and like this side go down more. Um, this is like the perfect brush for that. You kind of just go and then windshield by promotions. I'm gonna go in with the shade Burnt Orange in a soft glam palette. I did my teammate's makeup for her birthday. Her 21st birthday, Izzy. And then I did Sierra's makeup. They're both on my softball team. And I literally did like this, this basically like the same exact makeup look on them. Now I'm gonna use like a, a thicker brush, like this one, just like a thick brush. And I'm gonna diffuse the color. Just blending it. You don't have to put color on your brush. You can literally just use like a plain brush. I just have residue on this one because I haven't cleaned my brushes in a while. <laughs> and blend everything out so I can look seamless. <laughs> I want to go in with a winged like liner but using eyeshadow because I don't want it to be like super harsh. So I got this brush. It's like very, very small. Do I really have to do this right now? I don't even want to use my hand. I hate the fact that I just did that. Oh my god. I mean, but it works. Hopefully this turns out okay. I'm gonna lift my brow like this, this part right here. Just to make it sharper. Oops, fucked up already. So I finished my liner. Now I'm going to do my bottom lash line. I'm putting the shade face um, on my eyelid. Just like the inner corner area from the James Charles palette, just to give myself like a makeshift cut crease. I'm gonna be using the Tip Brow Gel from Anastasia to do my brows. And this is how I've been doing them lately. Oof, 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 oof. <sighs> this shit is powerful. My eyebrows look like absolute shit. They look like in building blocks. Did you guys hear that chicken? Oh. <laughs> Turkey. There it goes, there it goes again. I said chicken. I swear I call everything a chicken. So I finished my lashes. I used the lashes from Glamify Me in the style Issa. So if anyone wants it. To set my whole face, I'm going to use the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Finish Powder. I'm going to use this big powder brush. It's like fits my whole cheek. Now I'm gonna do bronzer 
and I'm gonna use the Kylie pressed bronzing powder in the shade Toasty. I like to push this up when you're putting on bronzer. You don't wanna go down with it because that'll make your face appear like wider. You wanna go like above your cheekbone because if you go too low, it'll see like when I smile, you can see this. It's like lifting my face. You don't wanna go under because it's gonna make your face look wider. And it will completely do the opposite of what the purpose of bronzer is for and like contour is for, so. Okay, so I'm gonna use the Morphe palette. This is the blush power. This is the Morphe blush palette in 8W Warm Master. And my Antonita gave this to me by the way too, so. Love you, Antonita. I always use like these three shades. And I kind of just like go in with those three. Um. I love blush so I like to put it right here because again it lifts if I put it on the sides like right here it'll like lift my face again a little bit more it'll like add like a lift to it so I'm just gonna put it like right here so when I smile lifts and I think you were probably supposed to do that, like you're always supposed to do that with blush, but I don't. So maybe I'm just like a little late on how to apply blush. I'm going to do a highlight and then I'm going to be using the Jaclyn Hill Loose Highlighter in the shade Extra. This sh Let me just tell y'all, if you don't have this, you need to get on it and get it because it's literally the best, best highlighter ever. I'm gonna set my face real quick. Oh, it smells so good. You guys ready for this? Wow, it just looks so I'm gonna use the MAC Strip Down Lip Liner. And then I'm going to use Clear Gloss. This is from Wet n Wild. This is literally just lip gloss. In the shade crystal clear <laughs> i had so much fun filming this video because i haven't done an eyeshadow look in months so just being able to like play around with makeup a little bit and get a little bit creative and artistic was nice and much needed um because of these past few months have been stressful i hope you guys enjoyed this video lovers watching i just hope that you guys stay healthy and safe and just have a great day I know when I watch makeup videos, it always makes me feel better. So I hope that I could do the same for you guys, whoever's watching. But anyways, I hope you, have, you guys have a great rest of your day whenever you guys are watching this. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay positive. Uh, I really appreciate everyone that watches my videos. So thank you guys so much. And if you want to, you can subscribe down below and like this video if you want. You don't have to. I'm just throwing it out there. And I will see you with more for you since I have so much time now cool peace out baby